What's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get an uh, NDS um, emulator on your iPhone, iPod Touch, 5th Gen, or iPad, any device running iOS 8 through iOS 8.1 and it's going to be for free. You're not going to have to pay anything um, but you it will require you to have a jailbreak um, which I'll post a link to the video that I did on how to jailbreak in the description though I'll, that's a two-part video. Um, it's a jailbreak video followed by how to install Cydia. You do not need to install Cydia because once you download the jailbreak now, Cydia is bundled with it, so it automatically install it for you. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and jump right in. So, um, as everybody knows that the D trick was patched when iOS 8.1 was released, so this is just going to sh show you how to get it. You're going to need to open up the Cydia store, and you're also going to need, I'll show you the repo. Just give it time to load. All right. We're going to type in NDS for iOS. Now you can use, we'll just go right here. Um, the repo that you're going to need is Insanely I, uh, which I'll post a link to in the description as well. Um, and if you don't know how to add it, you'll just click right here where it says sources. And you go up to edit and then add and then you'll type in the repo right here which if it's in the I'll post it in the description you can just copy and paste it <clears throat> alright so once you got that you search you find NDS for our iOS and you'll just click install and confirm and you'll just let this load it should only take a minute it's not too big of a file and make sure to watch the video like full way through just that you see everything that I do because it is a little different than the um, GBA emulator so just click return to Cydia alright so here's your N NDS for iOS and I have two ROMs currently installed right now um, but with this one it's different than GBA, GBA for iOS um, because you can't search for a ROM in the emulator so you're gonna have to uh, search it. You can either do it in Safari or Chrome. I'd recommend Chrome because it's a little easier and I'll show you why. Alright so what we're gonna do is you're gonna scroll down to where it says ROM files and then you're gonna select the Nintendo DS. And just give that a minute to load up. And now you can do any game or whatever you want, but we'll just top, click top 25, download it. Alright, and you got Pokemon Black, Heart Gold, Diamond, White, Soul Silver, Mario. Let's go with Mario Kart DS. Select that, let it load. And this is 18.21 megabytes, so I mean it will take a little while, not too long and you scroll down to where it says download now now if you do this in safari it's going to look different you're not even going to think that you're downloading anything so don't keep clicking on it because it will actually be downloading it's just in the background we'll go ahead and click download now alright you see here 19.1 megabytes and you'll click on download if you're in chrome if you're in safari you just click the download now and then it'll automatically start downloading but you have a little, uh, <clears throat> should tell you, estimate how many minutes it's going to take. Three minutes. Um, so I'll just skip through this and we'll pick up when it's finished and I'll show you uh, what the next screen is going to look like. Okay, once your download is complete, if you use Chrome, um, it'll say open in. Now, like I said, if you use Safari, it's probably going to take a little longer and um, you're not going to be able to tell how long it's going to take to download or the size of it or anything like that um, because it does everything in the background. That's why I recommend Chrome for this, just for this reason. Normally I use Safari, but go with Chrome on this. It makes it a little easier. But anyway, um, we'll click Open In. And then it'll give you these options here. And we're just going to click Open In NDS for iOS. Alright, now it's loading it. And there you see it, Mario Kart DS. Let's click on that. And you'll see it load up. And 
And there you go, guys. Mario Kart DS. And this is full touch screen. You don't have to just use these uh, dial pads or like the keypads here. Um, you can actually touch on the screen, like click yes or no on here, and it works that way. But that's how you get the NDS for iOS on your device. Um, you do have to be jailbroken for that, but that's how you do it. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. If you want to see more videos, please subscribe to my channel in, a, in the comment section below. If you want to request for a different emulator or uh, any other kind of video, just let me know, and I'll try and get on that. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.